hello everyone so welcome back again in the lab session so in the last video we had a brief idea of how to add subtract divide and multiply numbers but we were unable to see the input number once we get the answer like here or here we are or here we are unable to see what was the number we have entered so by checking at the formula bar we can only know now we'll see a user friendly way to add numbers okay like if i add if i enter one number in this cell if i enter another number in this cell and i want that in this cell the answer should come so that it will be very easy to understand that what was the number we took as a input and what is the answer so first for that first we have to know the position or location of the cell okay so suppose if i select this cell or this cell what is its position okay so to get this position we have an area where to know what is the position of this cell okay so the location is this here this is the name box okay so if I select this you see in the name box it is coming B and 6 similarly if I select this cell it will come A and 2 if I select this A and 2 is coming similarly if I select this it will come as D and 4 D and 4 similarly if I select let's say here so it is at the 16th row so 16 E so instead of uh, telling 16 E you could start with E and 16 so the moment I select this it is coming E 17 at the top it is coming E 16 so in this way you can get the cell name so suppose I select this cell this is C 7 here I enter one number that is a T press enter now I come to C 8 now press one another number let's say 70 now in c9 i want to see the answer so again to perform a mathematical operation we have to start with equal to sign then i have to enter the cell address so what is the address of on uh, position of this cell that is c7 so see the moment i after equal to if i select any cell it will mark as a uh, dotted symbol now put a plus symbol now select another one let's say c8 now press enter you see the answer so this is a very easy way to get the answer and it is clearly visible that what was our input and what is our output similarly if i change now here to let's say 40 and press enter automatic the answer will be changed you see Similarly here also if I change the value of this cell the answer will be changed. So this is uh, one example I have given. So practice at your home and if you have any doubt let me see in the comment box. So thank you very much.